What's going on guys? We're back from the video today and today I'm gonna to be showing you how to set up your Zim Apex to your um, PC. Now, and to your PC, so which is that for me. Now the first thing you wanna do, which I only unplug this real fast so you can show, show you the setup. So the first thing you wanna make sure you know about your keyboard when you're using Zim Apex on PC is that you'll need another keyboard. You don't need it, but like I don't have one right now or nor a USB switch, which is another thing you can do. There's two white ways you can solve this issue is if you have your Zim Apex your keyboard mouse plugged into your Zim Apex to the PC then you'll only be able to play the game and you won't be able to use the the cursor that thing um to your like to Discord and if you haven't already go check out my Discord it's um it's in the description the link is so yeah now what you'll need is another keyboard or mouse or a USB switch which I might um uh, put in the description a um link to a, a USB switch which you could buy I think like 30 bucks but yeah so I'm going to show you how to set it up real fast. It's really simple. It's like almost like console pretty much. So take your Zim Apex. I'm going to turn my flash on real fast. I'm professional. You want to plug it in. Make sure it goes in properly. Make sure it lights up like that. So that means it's on. You want to take this where you can see that. And you want to put your keyboard into port 3. So, which I don't know if it even matters what ports to put them in, but I just know the keyboard goes into it. So you want to take this, I'm going to go ahead and plug that into port 3 real fast. Okay, plug it in. Now you want to get your, you then want to get your mouse and plug that in to, plug that into that one, the right one, port 1. The last thing, another thing you'll need is that, so you, you'll need a controller, by the way, then should have told you at the beginning, but you'll need this. That's what plugs into your controller. So you take, you take this. Let me turn the flash off again. You take this, and you plug that in the back into that. That, and then this. Turn my flash on. And that goes right in the middle, right there. So let me go ahead and do that. Port two is where it goes into. Now, as you see, you want to leave your controller off because you'll see it turns on by itself. So don't even do that. And usually, where I plug my put my controller is is um on top of my PC. Oh, management, let's not talk about it. <laughs> um, that's it, guys. That's that's super simple. Now, as you can see, it's like, if it don't do this right away where it shows controller setup, you could just um maybe you're, click w, click a button on your um keyboard or move your mouse and it should work. And that's it. As you can see, I'm on PC, so you know I'm not lying. If I go to my settings, there you go. And that's it. I hope that, I hope this helps you. I hope, if you have any other questions, let me know and I'll give you more info on it. And that's it. Leave a like on the video. Thanks for watching.